Now, until now, we have seen much about the tables, how to create the tables, how to adjust the format of the tables and creating a raw table uh, or converting a text into the table. Now, let's see that if we have some figures in the table and we want to calculate the total of it, like uh, you want to apply some formulas to it, how can we do that? I have this file table formulas that I'll attach with the link of this video. So let's open it. I'll press enable editing. Now this is a sample of some company data, different categories of products. And we have the in-store sales, online sales. And here I have the total sales that is total of these two sales. So let's just select it and delete it. I want to create the total by myself. And similarly, I'll remove this totals as well. Now in Excel, we use a simple formula of sum to calculate these two sales. But in Word, I'll go to Layout and then click Formulas. Now my cursor is already here. So the formula will pick up some from the left of this table. So on the left, we have two figures. As soon as I press Enter, it will calculate the total. Now similarly, if I want to sum the second field, I'll go to Formula again. And by default, if it's sum above, just remove this and right left bracket close and click OK. Now, if you want to take the sum with a number format, any kind of format, you need decimal places you want in percentages or any comma style. So you can just select any format and click OK. So it will follow the format. Now in Excel, you can simply write a formula in one cell and then double click to apply it on the all fields. But in Word, it is little different. You have to apply it one by one in each field. So how can we make it little simple? If I go to formula and it says above, just change it to left. And then just copy this and click OK. And then similarly come in this field formula, remove it, paste it and press OK. Now in the bottom, if I want to total this column, so all the figures are above this field. So some will be for above. Uh, now I'll select this field, go to formulas and it will by default show above. Whenever you have the values above that particular cell, it will show a formula automatically. So just click OK. And similarly in the second field, uh, sum of above, click OK. And in the formulas, click OK. So that's how you can make the totals at the bottom. Now, one thing which you will find little different from Excel, that if I change the online sales figure, it will not automatically change the total. But what we have to do, we have to manually reapply the formula. I'll just click and press uh, OK. Make sure that formula is correct. And then it will update. So it is really as convenient as Excel. So basically, in short, Word is not about formulas. It is up about word processing. That means you can write applications, letters, any documents, enters any documents. In formulas, it will not work very efficiently like Excel, but if you want to make the totals. So that's how we can use some of the formulas in Word.